My name is Chomba Kalunga. I'm an actor. I'm known as Patrick Kabanana of the Kabanana Soap Opera Fame. I'm known as Dr. Jose of the At Least a Smile comedy series, as well as Jabulani of the Makoff Fame. Internationally, I'm known as Chifu Osia Kutako in Where Others Wavered movie. I'm a senior citizen. I'm also a senior actor. I have a word or two for presidents, former and the current president. Kutumpa uko. Kutumpa uko three times coming from a president's mouth referring to another president. Naritumpa ine trying to react to his fellow president. For me, it doesn't work well. You are our bosses. We are very unfortunate country. Others have got three, four, five living former presidents. We've only got one. The reason why we should preserve this one, and he should preserve himself. Our current president makes it them two. And if these two are not friends, who can be friends? To resort to insult, let me be frank. When people run out of ideas, they resort to insults, which is another form of war. All professions have got a language they use, whether they are annoyed or not. Engineers have got a language. Scientists have got a language. Prostitutes have got a language. Thieves, robbers have got a language. People in the bar have got a language. People in the church, they've got a language they use. And by their language, you can tell this one is an engineer, this one is a prostitute, this one is a scientist, by language. So the presidency has also got a language. Why? It's because it's the most high position in the land. So everything goes around the presidency. So if you get into the presidency, even the president himself respects the presidency. So, in very few words, I appeal to our two leaders, you have got followers, both of you, in thousands. If they all start calling themselves, are you sure we're going to preserve this peace, our former presidents, so much treasured and kept for us? Are you sure if Kaunda was alive, we would love to hear that conversation? No, not at all. I don't think so. So let's look at the presidency. Let's respect and honor the presidency. And the only people that can start honoring this presidency are the presidents themselves. You are all presidents. We love you, we respect you, we honor you. We are not going to drop one for another or one for the other, no. We are, you are the only two we have. Our beloved presidents, former and present too. And you know what? As a concerned citizen, 
I don't feel we can divide each other over this. Let's put this to rest and move forward. Let not the Mupando issue divide us. Because what is important is not the Mupando. And stop this issue of listening to young people who are coming up with excitement and what? And you get caught up? No, no, you also get caught up? No, 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 no. These are young people who don't understand what is involved in life. They say it for money, they say it for, for, for fame, they say it for anything. But they should be controlled by the presidency. All of us in this country, we have been controlled by the presidents. We appeal to you on behalf of all Zambians. Please put a stop to this.